Hey everybody, welcome back. If you're new here, hi, I'm Mercury. Welcome to my channel. It's my daily vlog, so whatever I'm up to is what you're gonna see here. And today I am still on Royal Caribbean's Explorer of the Seas. And something, if you've seen my videos before on my cruises, I love the towel animals, the towel folding. So I'm about to go and check out the towel folding seminar. They're holding it on the pool deck, so I'm not sure how good of a view I'm gonna have. We'll see how it goes. But after the towel folding seminar, I'll show you some clips of the towels that I've gotten throughout the cruise. So come, let's go find out about towel animals. Okay, so here we go. Making the dog right here, what you need is a bath towel. Okay, so bath towel. Now lay it nice and flat on a surface as a table, or if you just have your bed, you can do it in your bed. All you have to do now is roll both ends towards the center. Okay, so roll both ends towards the center. Make sure that you're doing this nice and tight. As well, as you can see, she got the corners on the outside, okay? The corners on the outside will tell you why. Because later on, she's going to pull it, okay? So it stays nice and tight, okay? So here we go. Do the same thing from the other side. Roll it, but you want it to also be the exact same size, all right? So right like that, now you're going to take it, fold it in half, and then making sure that the humps, the humps, right there is facing outward, okay? So if you're doing it the other way, it's not gonna work. Now, she's going to pull out the rest of the corners, and then she's gonna take both sides, both corners in the opposite direction, and pull really hard, okay? Now, if you do not pull it hard, okay? If it's not done nice and tight, it'll fall apart on you. And when you finish, it's shaped like a chicken. Okay, now you're ready for barbecue. Okay, so just like that, you lay the dog that way, or in this case, it's the Filipino dog, it's the aso. Okay, so, and now it's gonna make the head, she's gonna make the head. Now, taking the hand towel, fold it into an oblong, all right, a long, uh, like in half, put your finger right in the middle, and pull the top two corners towards you, all right? So, just like that, and it's going to fold the top part over, about three or four inches over, She's like, a, yeah, she's going way too fast. Okay, so, and then, and she's going to roll the ends towards the center after she pulls it in a little bit, all right? So here we go. Now this is going to formulate the head, the nose, and the ears of the dog. Just like that. And this is what they call the bulldog. There you have it. Nice and simple, yes? Who thinks they can make it at home now? Yes? Now, um, you know, it depends how you look at it, it can also be a pig. Yeah, yes? You think? Okay, so he's gonna do the body first, okay? So he's gonna do the body first. Alrighty. Folding the hand towel in half, just like that. And then, of course, again in half to make it like a triangle. Okay, so now that basically is almost ready. But oh, there, he's making the head right now. Okay, so now he's going to fold, uh, roll it over to the end, just like that, and then fold it in the opposite direction so you can create the beak. Okay, so just like that. And then, of course, using a rubber band to keep it in place. In this case, it's using two, just to make sure it doesn't run away. Okay, so now it's almost ready. This is simple, very easy. The bottom part will also act as the legs of the penguin. Now, now becomes of course uh, the, the jackets of uh, the penguin. Now he's going to lay this right in the middle and he's going to wrap it up just like that. Make sure you got it nice and tight and underneath. Then once you wrap it over to the other side, you tuck in the corners of the back. I think this penguin has been to the Winjaman. <laughs> As I said, the, the end part of the first piece now becomes the legs of the, the penguin. Now he pulls it out nicely such. That's the legs, as you can see, the little tail. 
and then now it's going to do the rest of the jacket and the wing of the penguin. Now, simple as that, just get the face towel, fold it into a triangle, tuck the edges in, or not the complete edges, but just closer to the edges, so you can have the straps on both sides. Okay, on both sides like that. There we go, that should keep it in place. So there it is, everybody. So give him a big round of applause. This is the <laughs> Oh, this is a special elephant. from Bali, Indonesia. All right. Going to, of course, uh, shape up the head so it stays in place. Yeah, so there you have it, everybody, the baby dinosaur. All the kids are coming down, look at that. Just like that, everybody. Come on, give him a big round of applause. Well done, well done. Okay. It has begun. We have returned to the room and there is a towel animal. It is beginning. Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Then we have this little, I think he's an elephant and he's wearing my sunglasses. He's wearing my sunglasses and he's like chilling. I presume elephant or perhaps anteater or aardvark by the long nose. Roy says elephant. I think he's adorable. That's what I say. Adorable. And so the towel animal journey continues. There is a new towel animal in our room today. We came in and there's a monkey towel. Look, he's got googly eyes and everything. He's great. I love him. We gotta find a place for him. But, but, they, they took the elephant aardvark and turned him into the monkey. So we don't have a menagerie. There's no menagerie. <laughs> just, just today's monkey. But he's good, he's adorable. I love him. We just came back to the room and towel shenanigans continue. There, there's a strobe effect going on. Towel shenanigans continue. Let me show you today's towel animal. Look, there's a little mouse. There's a little towel mouse on the bed. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. He has googly eyes. And a little tail. He's so adorable. However, my menagerie disappears every day. So on some cruises, they leave the previous to towel animal for you. Um, he keeps my, my stateroom attendant seems to keep unfolding and refolding the same towel for the towel animal. So, unlike last time where I had a whole menagerie of towels, and I'll put the link up for that towel video, um, this time I'm getting a new fresh one every day, but it's the only one I'm getting. So after all of the uh, stateroom attendants did their towel fo folding, the host did his, uh, did his towel folding. And he, uh, he called me up and he asked me to hold a towel while he was making it. And when he finished, it was a bird. And then he was like, wait, wait, I'm not done yet. The bird needs a home. And he made a nest. And then he said I could, could take it back. So I, I acquired another towel animal. So now there is a bird in a nest to accompany my mouse. Yes. So I always have so much fun with the towel folding. I, I keep saying that I'm going to like remember to bring instructions how to do towel folding on my next cruise so I could like have a towel folding challenge with my stateroom attendant. I don't know if I'll remember to do it or not, but if I remember, I think it would be a lot of fun. So those are the towel animals that I got. That was the towel folding demonstration they had on the ship this time. And with that, I am done for today and I will see you all tomorrow. And until then, stay inspired by everyone.
Take care.